Mm. Well, he's an obvious challenge because he is 16 feet tall and there aren't very many people around we can find that are 16 feet tall and connect. He's a very difficult character to realise. In the very beginning, we shot a live-action actor, Tony Maudsley, and we motion captured his performance. Capturing a performance involves placing markers all over an actor's body and cameras pick up those markers and sensors figure out where those markers are in three-dimensional space. That's captured by a computer software package and translated onto a skeletal rig in the computer and replicates that actor's motion in 3D space inside a computer. The director saw Tony's performance, loved the spirit of it, but pretty much told us not to be slaves to that actual data and to go ahead and use the spirit of it and build on that to see where we could go. Robbie, that is not polite. There's a really hilarious scene where Grawp picks Hermione up. We have um, bits of Grawp made out of foam rubber, which we can put onto uh, armatures and stands, and the uh, the actors can interact with that. On set, Rupert ran up with a stick, but instead of hitting Grawp's leg, he's hitting a giant blue polyurethane version of Grawp's leg. But that gives him something to actually see and actually hit. And also, it's a, it's a guide for us, because we know where Grawp's leg is meant to be. Grawpy! That's one of my favourite scenes so far, actually, because I get to do a little stunt. Ron feels a bit, he wants to be the hero sort of thing and tries to beat up the giant. So he grabs his leg and uh, I get kicked off, which was my little stunt. <laughs> and there's Ron in vain on the floor trying to save her. It's really sweet. It's a really sweet scene.